Hey guys, Hent here. In today's video, I will show you how I managed to complete Otsdava's All Park Streak. I hope you enjoy. Astava has been trying to complete the streak for a bit over a month now and I've watched him for many hours trying to complete this. He said that he's totally open to other people putting their own spin on the perk distribution and killer order and attempt to complete it. I had a bit of a different strategy compared to him and I want to explain to you what I had in mind. But let's first talk about the rules of the streak. This challenge requires me to get 27 wins in a row with all killers. A win is a 3k or 4k by any means. Using each perk exactly once. Killer order and perk distribution are completely free. No add-ons are allowed. For offerings, blood point offerings or sacrificial wards are okay. The rest is forbidden. This challenge was insanely brutal and needed some extremely efficient killer play. I sorted the killers into three tiers based on their base, strength and how well they scale with perks. The low tier killers were fairly weak, needing some luck in terms of map and opponents to win. Medium tier were okayish builds and still needed some help and the high tiers were actually fairly strong and supposed to be able to win nearly every matchup. I did this to waste as little time as possible per attempt and to have the highest odds possible if I actually managed to get to the high tiers. Over 60% of my failed attempts ended on my first four killers, without much time invested into the attempt at all. This challenge required very extreme efficiency in terms of gameplay as there's close to no room for error with no add-ons and midi core perks on a majority of those killers especially on the low tier killers, efficiently reducing the amount of survivors by not splitting the hooks too much was the winning strategy. As a killer, you pretty much need to kill two survivors to end the game, as it's almost impossible for survivors to progress the game in a two versus one. If possible, contesting unhooks, trying to get grabs was crucial to consistently win on low tier killers with close to no perks. To be more precise, efficiently blocking survivors to give them as little unhook attempts as possible. I only did this when I knew for a fact that survivors were close to the hook and not doing gens. This won me a lot of games since the average survivor does not really deal well with those situations and it makes bad maps winnable even on the lowest tier killers with no useful perks. I think the more I tried the streak, the more ruthless I played overall, trying to punish every survivor mistake to the best of my ability. This streak was nothing for survivor rulebook enthusiasts, but sometimes you need to test your limits and see what you can do if you go all out. So in total it took me 35 attempts to complete the challenge. I did it in 2 weeks and I invested over 50 hours trying to complete it. 214 wins, 34 losses, a win rate of 86% total. 65% of those losses are with the first four killers, Myers, Pig, Nemesis and Trapper. I only won half the games that I played on Cowshed and in my final attempt no survivor actually escaped through the gates after the gents got done. But enough numbers for now, I want to show you some of the games that I think are the most noteworthy from the streak. The first two games were actually fairly easy, but the third game was probably the craziest game of the streak. I had two hooks with no survivor on death hook, while the survivors had only one gen left to do, and one of the three remaining ones was already on 90%. The situation was super hopeless, but I'm glad I didn't give up, because in the end I managed to snowball it. The second game I want to show you was the Deathslinger game, one of the cleanest games that I played in the streak. I played it very well, hit insane shots and made it very hard for the survivors from the very get go. A very nice game to also show what I mean with playing ruthless and punishing any survival mistake. The third game is Oni, the 21st game of the streak. Oni didn't have the strongest build but he's a very strong killer. This was another nail biter and on the brink of being lost against very good survivors that made it very hard for me, but we managed to climb back at the end. 
The fourth and final game is the last pyramid head game. He had a strong build and this game was never truly in danger. But it was a nice ending and this video wouldn't be complete without the last game. Guys, I hope you enjoy. Like it. <laughs> actually, this W is not. You have what? Why wouldn't you? You have life. Oh, okay. That's strong pathing by her. Does she make the main? Hit, and that's about it. And now she can run the main on me, which means I need to leave her. That was a bad start. And this mag is running. Absolutely nowhere. I like this. Another life. It's really trendy right now. Decision. What's up, though? There's some serious pallet droppage. Into window? That is strong, bro. No, she doesn't. Why would you not paint that window? Yeah. That was bad. That was so bad. I should have a moment. She doesn't understand that she can change this into Shack. Okay. Genlock? Not really. This is a rough spot. Two infections. And zombies and darting main can help a little here. Yeah, okay, nice. Laurie's ready to run main here. Zombie. To help a little. Hmm. Well, it's gonna be a hard one for sure though. He's resetting over there, the Lori. With life. Let's try this one and go back. That would have been huge. Now you keep the gen at what cost though. Like they're just gonna do others. This is not efficient for me. On a very open big map. That really doesn't help me. That's a vaccine. can get all this but this may be a snowball I mean this is a lorry let's keep that in mind right yeah, this girl is leaving mm. one else she just doesn't want to go basement she heals up okay I'm extremely surprised that, that didn't hit. I don't know why that didn't hit. I'm gonna be real honest. Oh, the thing about playing around the main building, dude. Let's go. No one has time to work again. Really? Okay. Let's put you on the hook real quick. Get the second. I mean, they can fit the general, realistically. I can't really. Hold that forever. Do they? 
Okay. Yeah, they should wait. I don't make it in time. There's no way. Unless. Wait. No, no, no one is doing it. Interesting. And she's getting zoned into. Ooh, can I three men slug this now? That would be huge. Let's talk her. Laurie's death oak, that's good. But they have nothing to do. They're gonna just gonna hop back onto the gen. They're just gonna finish it, right? Yeah. Unless they reset. Okay, they don't. Is that a solo now? I have no idea. I'm just guessing. Oh, it's opening that one. I kinda need some ultras in here. To be able to make this injured Megan. Going bad. She actually has it. Oh, okay. Should have cut her off there. Bit of a blunder. I think she's life, right? That's, that's gonna cost me like three meters, that rubber band. It's really annoying. Okay, I'm gonna suck her here. Are they just gonna leave? Oh, no, no. <gasps> Huge. Bro. Where is she? No way, bro. Okay. Which gate got opened? That's the question, yeah. Okay. One more rubber band for the boys. I'll make that. Oh, she's lighting into the world. And she crawled. Good. Oh, this guy's coming. I think. Yes. Nice. Unforge, unforge. This Franklin's currently on. Uh, it was on Wraith, but I can just swap it again. Dude! Did you just see that? Sky Nemesis? Did you just see that? Oh, this is a beautiful map. Right, let's go. They're probably gonna find totems close to instantly. Hopefully they're gonna pop haunted, obviously. Okay, right, the game has started, by the way. Someone's actually above. Good to know. Uh, if I injure them that way, they cannot trade. Oh, an else can trade for them. But they cannot trade themselves. Oh, 
I don't think they're thinking this through right now. You're not making this. There's no way, Jose. Fuck, come on, this is sad. Alright, he's back up. I got another basement hook. I can slug this guy. Do that. Uh, huge shovels. Are they still on top? No, they are not. Okay. Oh, she's injured already. Right now, okay, no DH. Didn't oh, oh. trade. Oh, bro, that was such a horrible shot. He's dead, like he can't trade. Okay. I just heard him though. Oh, she, he did trade. Okay. That's fine. Cool. This is the first kill then. Bro, are you doing the gen buff? There's no way. Someone else DC. Oh, he DC'd. Yeah, not gonna lie, without that T-Bag, I think she would have been out of range. Uh, I think I can this. No, I do not. Oh. You're mad, Mac. You're mad. Oh, bro. Do you see, I predicted her dodge, but she did it so late that it literally didn't matter anymore. I want to destroy you, dude. Come. Can I I got did I got mad retry value. That's the good thing about retry. You will always get value. You know? Dejection? Oh! Damn! Okay, nice. I thought it was a baby mech to be honest, but she played that pretty well. Hi, Panda. I kind of got confused for a second. Bro, are you in the hell? What? Actually, you're in power control. Why? 
Oh, you're dead now. Oh, you're dead now, dude. Oh my god, Megan. You need to think, man. You need to think before you act. You cannot give up pellet control against the Death Singer. But the build is kind of cracked, to be honest. Like, on hit is always cool on Death Singer, obviously. And obviously, the Retribution Pox were always insane. Death Singer is a fun killer. It's so easy to get W, though. I actually lost that. I used to play... Dude, when Deathslinger... Okay, I'm a shooter player. When Deathslinger released, I got to the front page. I was... I was grinding Deathslinger. Super hard. She didn't go left. And... No, I don't play him that much anymore. <laughs> oh, Safo, that is so good. I have lethal too. I know someone is on my side. I just need to get the first hit in a reasonable manner. One, two, three, four. Okay, three middle. And one on my side. Interesting spawns. Playing it safe. I'm going mid map. Okay. That is. Very decent time frame. Get first hit in. It didn't say mid map. Interesting. Okay, three. Where are the others? Someone on this? Yes. Okay, let's ball. Ooh, there are lots of fillers around here, to be honest. Let's go. We cover on the box. Do we pick? Do we pick? Yeah, we do pick. I do pick. I pick those. Okay. That is lens in a flash. I actually probably see the black water. Okay. We still got blood here. Yeah, 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 free power, free power. Okay, let's go. What? Get the free trade? I don't think so. Okay. Mm. Get rid of this. She says the edge. Okay. Middle map is done. I was the gens been looking by the way. One, two, three. Four. Four gen bot side. Okay. I was gonna power this. Where's Mech running? Mech seems a bit lost. Uh, I saw her. I'm gonna go for Mech anyway. No! What? Wait, did she just hide corner? No, she didn't. I'm stupid. That's a gen. Mm. Risky, bro. Nice! I get that. Means she probably didn't do gens. Not the worst thing in the world. Okay, okay. that gen is done. It's right there. Wait, what? This palette is gone. Okay. 
I think I can afford to camp this. I think I was walking this either. Are you coming for rescue? Let's see. Oh, I don't see anything. Well, they reset actually. This thing. No way! Okay. Now I can kill her. She's dead. They can't, they can't, they can't. No, they can! She's the only one standing! Okay. Mm, I wanna pick, I wanna pick. Who do I pick? Isn't he as fast like this isn't? Not sure. Okay. I need to rotate those uh, hooks. No, she's fast. Okay. I'm gonna secure this one. Alright, no where she is. Let's go. Mm, no, she can one for one. Only one for one. It'll be fair. Nice. Okay, she's dead. Did you? Okay. We spawn in the middle. I'm gonna guess they spawn to the left of the main building, but they could be split. What the? I mean, this is not a bad map. Not crazy good either. Yeah, someone definitely spawned here. Nice. And that's first hit. Dude, this guy has a map. You wanna get tormented? Free, it's free, it's free. It's free, bro. Literally free real estate. Uh, it's so free, bro. You have no idea how free it is. Alright. Alright, Stevie. Well, can we interrupt gents? That was that one. I don't wanna go too far away from this hook. Yeah, please unlock. Yeah, unlock. It's fine. Okay, Adam does not want to unlock. He's being useless right now, though. Oh, she stopped you working at Jenny, too. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, Adam. Can't dodge this one, really, can you? Okay, Stevie. Okay, I'm just gonna end it. I'm just gonna go for him. Go dodge. Oh, my flick glitched out. So annoying. I mean, it doesn't matter if you <laughs> avoid the torment. Mm. Okay. Why did that not connect? Okay. Well, this guy really likes summon, doesn't he? Mm. Any 
animation is so goofy. I like how you always vaults in front of me. Crazy. Alright. I'm just gonna send him to the other side and end it. I'm pretty sure this is not gonna be the hardest game of this week. This guy is such a torment snacker. Huh? Alright. Efficient as shit. Let's go. Actually, someone's walking this. <laughs> okay. I he probably didn't know he signed up for a tournament, but oh. Dude, what the fuck is he doing? I have no idea, man. I have no idea. Damn, I guess that's it. I need sense to die. Thanks so much for five, Leko. Appreciate it. Leko! What? Zepin, thanks so much for watching for gifting 50 subs. Oh my god. Jeez. It's over. No way. No way, it's over. Alright. It's done. Oh, bro. Oh my god. Thank you so much. Angel. Thank you so much, Stevie. Thank you so much. Panda. Admiral. Thank you so much. Thanks, guys. Jeez. Oh, it's done. Ah, thank you so much for getting five. It's done. We won 27 times in a row. Okay, Hi. for the record, we need to do this.